what is going on guys welcome back to the channel so i actually wanted to start this video off right now asking a question why do we not have the 25 percent xp and buck bonus on the regular events in the game and not just in grand races like am i the only one asking that question don't get me wrong guys i'm probably 100 percent sure that they most likely did this on purpose like everybody go into the grand races get that 25 percent booster let's be honest here how many people are doing the demolition royale I would probably say not that many like a lot of players don't care for it so a lot of them probably are going to do the grand races which you know currently is pretty much the only pvp game mode in the game so you pretty much have to do it so i would say in some way they're probably like you know promoting that to make players go into it and go oh yeah like a 25 percent booster i do know getting in like the top five or something you'll probably get around maybe like 55k of like XP or something and then probably around 80 to 90 thousand dollars might be a little bit less than you know if you can win the event having like the actual vehicle from the main stage bonus I think it's like a hundred and almost 20 grand and probably around 80,000 or so 75,000 XP so like it is a lot and then if you add somebody into that you're probably going to get even more but like, just wondering here, can we actually get the 25% boost on the regular events in the game having extra money and XP from them? Like, imagine doing the Liberty Territory but having the booster active or, like, you know, pretty much doing any of the main events around the map and having it. I do know not everybody wants to play PvP, but, like, seeing a 25% boost, you're like, oh, more money and XP. And, you know, a lot of the events in PvP tend to be around maybe 5 to 8 minutes, so... They're probably going to be a bit shorter, so maybe having like a 25% boost on the main events in the game probably is a better way to do it. And that way it's probably going to encourage a lot more players to do the playlist events. And you know, one thing I was thinking about though is why not have the 25% boost on the grand races and the main playlist events. That way if you actually want to do both for that week or two then you have the option to do it. And you know what's funny though is one of the other ways I look at this though is let's say you might not be the biggest fan of PvP like not everybody wants to play it. And even if there is going to be a booster on money and XP, some players are like, you know what, well, if I'm not getting in the top 5 or like top 7, am I really getting a lot of money and XP? Like, if I jumped on the regular playlist events, I'd probably make a bit more. And what's kind of crazy about this, though, is that's going to be a pretty valid point. Let's say you are doing some of the grand races and you get around 15th to like 17th place. You are probably only going to get maybe around thirty-five to maybe $40,000 and you're probably not going to get that much XP from it. So for example here, if they did end up adding a 25% boost to the main playlist events in the game, I feel like you would actually make more money from it. On top of that, you would also be able to do the events at like your own pace or like, you know, pick your own vehicle of your choice and actually just jump in. And the other great thing about this though is if you were grinding out the playlist, you can easily go around to any of the playlists around the map and pick any vehicle of your choice. Whereas if you were to do something like a grand race, you are going to be forced to use certain classes that you might not even want to use or even be a big fan of them. On top of that, guys, getting around 10th, 11th, 12th, and like, you know, even getting around 17th or 18th place in one of the grand races, you are most likely not going to be making a lot of money in XP anyway, so why not add the 25% boost in the main events in the game? giving a player the option if they actually want to do it. Now, I did mention before they probably have to do something with that navigation race because, um, you know, everybody's probably going to grind that one out and make 60k every 40 seconds. So a nerf for that is definitely going to be coming. So if you are doing it, I would recommend doing it as much as you can before it's gone because, you know, it definitely will be. But besides all that, though, guys, I really do hope we end up seeing the main playlist actually getting a 25% booster. Not only would it be insanely good, that way players can jump into that, but they're also not going to have to be forced to only play grand races.